Hey, someone, 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 Israel. Giving up praise to the hour. By Shem, you have a shout. By Shem, I could dust the one. See, that was a GMS rule. I'll say, chase two. I give my dear person this word of truth and sincerity. Risking your freedom, your life to do so. Uh, now more than ever before in history, because we're at the time of the end, and we're gonna make. I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna make this quick. But just to give a further update of what's going on, you know, in this world, and um. Specifically, where we're located, you know, um, in New York. Well, I'm in New York, but um, you know, just American, you know, because this is the whore. The city's for pumping many waters, and this is the place of uh, the biggest uh, hub of our captivity. You see, in the affliction, this is Babylon. This is spiritual Sodom and Egypt. Okay, so this is the you know, the the this this country has um. Uh, very prevalent in um, prophecy. And its decadence, meaning its fall, means a lot to prophecy, okay? It means the Lord is really putting that hammer down. So it says, um, this is from CB, uh, CNBC. This is Wednesday, May 12th, which we're in, I think this is the 12th, or, excuse me, it's the 20th, so this is about a week ago. Says two thirds of Americans live paycheck to paycheck as inflation continues to climb. Now, there's no worse feeling than to live paycheck to paycheck. As soon as you get your check, all your money's going to bills. That's, I mean, I used to live like that, you know, many and many, many, two thirds, man. So, two out of every three people you meet is living paycheck to paycheck. That is extreme, okay? The odds of that, that means 70%, I believe, 60, no, 70%, yeah, about 70% out of 100, or two out of every three people you talk to is living paycheck to paycheck. It, it, it's, it's insane, it's insane, meaning everybody just barely have their nose above water. Most people are broke, most people are poor, most people can't pay, to, pay their bills, and and like I said, That'll put everybody on edge, okay, okay, closer to, to, to the point of breaking and snapping and stealing and robbing from people and murdering, you see? So this all correlates with prophecy. We're going to get that. So it said two-thirds of Americans live paycheck to paycheck as inflation continues to climb. So it says the surging cost of living due to inflation has strained household finances nearly across the board. When inflation is still near 40-year highs, close to two-thirds of Americans are living paycheck to paycheck in course to one report. Inflation is showing no signs of slowing down, making it harder for workers to make ends meet. The consumer price index increased 8.3% from a year ago, higher than 8.1% estimate, according to the U.S. Bureau of Statistics. Although it was down slightly from the March peak, inflation still is still growing at the fastest annual pace in about four decades, 40 years. Rising prices are putting household budgets in advice, said Greg McBride, chief finalist analyst at Bankrate.com. Price increases are widespread, but look at food and shelter, which together account for 40 percent of the waiting uh, waiting in the CPI and more than that for many households. Now, price says um, for food and shelter. Yeah, man, inflation affects the food prices. So it causes your food prices to skyrocket. And then shelter, you know, rent prices or mortgages. Like, look at rent now, man. Just uh, a couple years ago, especially in New York where I'm at, you know, a couple years ago, I remember when you can get a studio for damn $900, $800, 900 Now a studio in the same area costs about thirteen dollars or $1,400 a month. And, 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 and our um, damn salaries didn't go up much, you know, to keep pace with a, with a 9% uh, inflation increase. Like, I just had a union contract um, increase, and it was only 2%. Now, imagine I lived above above my means, which I know a lot of people do. They drop Mercedes, they got houses and families, and they can't afford none of this stuff. But now a lot of people are starting to feel it. Like, like, like this title says, two out of every three Americans you see 
uh, is living paycheck to paycheck. Even though they they smile and they have nice clothes, they they could barely keep up with their lifestyle. They literally get their check and, and it's coming out, you see? So, and that's going to make a man, um, an Israelite man, more precious to find gold. But that's another video. So food, food prices are up at the fastest pace in more than 41 years. And the shelter index, which makes up about one third of the CPI waiting, was up 5.1 on a yearly basis, its fastest gain since March 1991. While wage growth is high by historical wage uh, standards, it isn't keeping up with the increased cost of living. When wages rise at a slower place than, than inflation, those paychecks won't go as far at the grocery store and at the gas pump, two areas of the budget that have been particularly squeezed. And, and, and um, yeah, man. So it says grocery store and gas pump. Man, a lot of people ain't filling up the gas to 100%. A lot of women going to sell at that, that ASS. Or them that rear that butt um, for for gas, or to feed their their family. You know they might be single mothers and any. A lot of women gonna be giving up that 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 kitty for 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 them. Um, some ramen noodles, man. Or, or some food, or maybe to put some gas in their price to work three job work their three jobs. You see. Right now is not the time to have no wife or, 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 you know, children, if you can avoid it. You know, I understand brothers might have got caught up in that situation, man. It may, may be God speed to you, but if brothers hear my voice, man, you know, wrap up. Wrap up. Strap up. Helmet on all the time. Don't be out there getting married, man. We are in some serious times. Uh, it says, uh, more personal finance, credit card debt is heading to an all-time high. More Americans grab strap. As cost of living rises, Americans say inflation may have big negative impact. All right, so let's get a scripture, man. Ezekiel 7, verse 19. They should cast their silver in the streets. And that happened during the time of um, the Weimar Republic. Um, I believe in Germany. When, when I forgot, I think it was the ruble. Don't quote me. But it just became super worthless. And they just threw it out and they burnt it. And say, and their gold should be removed. Uh, yeah, so when they said they cast their silver in the street, man, the money became worthless. They had to get rid of it. You know? It says, uh, and their gold should be removed, and their silver and their gold should not be able to deliver them in a day of the wrath of the Lord. They should not satisfy their souls, neither fill their bowels, because it's a stumbling block of their iniquity. And it's the reason why all this is happening is because Most High is bringing judgment down to these nations, man. Even our people for the wickedness that this world uh, has come to, man. Let's get one more last last scripture. Is that for now? One and eleven. How ye and to have it in some Magtash. Magtash was a um a, a, a seaport uh, in Israel where they would receive um goods. So it was money. It was a money land, like 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 a stock market. Where you would sell a whole bunch of things, trade. For all the merchant people are cut down, and all they that bid sell are cut off. Right. And that's that's going into your money is gonna become worthless, man. All your wealth is gonna be gone. So yeah, man, just you know, this is time to uh get right with the Lord, stay focused. We are living in some crazy times, brothers. Um like I said, don't be shacking up having no kids right now. Having no family and things like that, man. All that done with, man. To the kingdom. So with that, give up his yahoo. Bashim, yahoo, shah. Bashim, chakadash. The one said, that was a G-Mask. Till next video. Shalom.